build up a good partnership for dialogue. Good partnership is one of the strengths of Key Action 3 structured dialogue projects. Building such partnerships is essential for making a sustainable impact at policy level. Structured Dialogue Projects aims at empowering young people to influence the decision-making process at a specific level – local, regional, national or European. The composition of the partnership within the project should be relevant to the level of influence expected. For example, many decisions affecting young people are made at municipality level. Therefore, if young people want to participate in influencing such decisions at this level through a structured dialogue project, then the partnership should involve relevant organisations and institutions, including policymakers. It may be that the projects in different countries involve local municipalities together with youth groups, local youth councils or other civic organisations. It is very important that all parties involved in the project have similar interests in or concerns over specific issues of youth policy. The partnership is more likely to be effective if interests, effort and contributions are equally shared. A good participatory project consists of consulting and involving all partners in the project design and implementation prior to the project proposal being submitted. Project objectives, activities and outcomes should reflect each partner's interests and should be commonly agreed. When building a partnership for a structured dialogue project, it is important to be familiar with the working cultures of all parties involved. Often, the cultures of organisations and institutions influence the nature of the participation. Both young people and decision-makers can learn about each other, develop a better understanding of how decisions are made and how participation can work better. Therefore, it is important to find types of structured dialogue that are suitable for the different kinds of people that will be involved in the project. It is also worth considering the events, activities and election cycles that may serve as a platform for structured dialogue activities. If the project aims to include young people who are underage, then it is important to involve parents or guardians as well as teachers. Young people in this age group are still very much dependent on their families and school lives. This may have an impact on their participation and involvement in the project's activities. It is advisable to involve parents and teachers early on in the project design process and later on in the project activities too.